Hi guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make damper. It's an Australian classic. This is my grandmother's recipe, uh, which can be used as a savory or a sweet. I usually have it in the winter time, but I'm going to have it for afternoon tea this afternoon. Anywho, let's start. Basically just sift in the flour through. So roughly one and a half tablespoons of butter. Make sure you have clean hands too guys. So basically just going to uh, crumb the butter into the flour. I don't know if that's the term of knowledge but anywho. Just yeah basically getting the butter and just rubbing it into the flour until it resembles crumbs. Don't know what happened there, but anywho, continuing on. You want to make sure you get all the butter too. And there's all different ways to make damper. Uh, Water and flour, perfectly okay if you're on a budget, I guess. Uh, other people put in lemonade. I did that once, didn't turn out right, so I just stick to what my grandmother showed me.
Also, I'd like to point out too, make sure your butter is at room temperature. And slowly but gradually get in there. Your hands do become a bit sore. Good little workout. I don't know what you're working out, but yeah. So yeah, sharing this recipe with you guys because my sister always asks, how do you make damper? And here you go. I can't feel any clumps of butter, so. I use the same ingredients for scones as well, so you can always turn it into scones rather than damper. See how I'm just using my hands, my fingers, just to feel for the butter and then just to rub it into the flour. It is a bit of a process, but it's well worth it in the end. Mm -hmm. um, I usually don't use measurements, I just basically go by it looks and how it feels so roughly I put in a um, quarter of a cup of cream and gradually just going to add milk
And then just go into knead it a bit. Usually just knead it into a, a round ball. It's basically using this part of the hand. feels too wet or sticky just keep gradually adding a little bit of flour not too much You can um, take it out of the bowl and knead it on the on the bench, but I don't know. I just like doing it like this. Saves cleaning up more. If it was to knead it on the on the bench, just make sure your your bench is a bit is floured it also. If you put it on the bench without flour, it's just gonna stick. Okay. Preheated oven, 190 degrees for roughly uh, 55 minutes. I usually turn the temperature down the last 20 minutes, so I turn it down to 160, just so it can um, build a crust around it. Okay, but yeah, that's that's my damper, which is going in the oven. Okay, thanks guys. Talk soon. Please subscribe, like or comment to my channel. Peace.